Hey, welcome back to the Car Shocker. My name is Jimmy Prater. I'm a car closer. That's what I do. I close and close and close. I close car deals. And you close and close and close car deals, right? And you want to close more car deals. And there's a way to do that. That's called training. You got to train. You can't be complacent. You got to train. Because complacency kills sales. It kills business. It kills morale. You got to constantly train. But it's got to be the right training. It has to be the right training. You just don't throw a book at a salesperson and say, here, read this. You just don't open a textbook and say, hey, I'm going to train you. See, training's bigger than reading out of a book. Training is about energy. You got to have the energy in the store before you can start training. Because we know that motivation feeds off from Energy, right? But it's got to be positive energy. That's what you got to do. You got to have positive energy. And then that will motivate somebody to want to learn. We all learn different ways. Some people like to read from a book. Most salespeople don't. I don't like to read from a book and learn how to sell. It's hands-on. And you got to train hands-on. If you have a trainer inside your store, that just opens a book and trains and trains and trains and trains and trains. It's like a stair step, but it's going down like your morale. It doesn't work. You have to have a trainer with some energy. You have to have a trainer that's ready to motivate. You have to, you have, to have a trainer that is passion. Wow, what a concept, right? I might know a good trainer for you. The car sharker. Yeah. I'm motivated to train. I got high energy. I love people. I love the clothes and clothes and clothes. See, these big conglomerates, they have their trainers inside, right? And this is how we want you to train. This is how you're going to train. You can't train sales one-on-one because that's your personality. How are you going to train personality? you got to bring the personality out. The only way to bring the personality out is to have positive energy inside the store. Once you bring the personality out, that's the motivation. That's the motivation. If you don't have the motivation, you're not going to train. You're not going to train if you don't have the motivation. I can't imagine, and I've done it. I mean, I've been in the business for almost three decades. I've done it, but I can't imagine doing it anymore. Sitting there and have a trainer stand up and saying, hey, this is how you do it. This is how you do it. Remember the stairs? This is how you do it. There goes your morale. There it goes. Oh, it's it's gone. That's your morale. That's your morale. See, the manufacturers already give salespeople. They already give salespeople enough tests. They log on. They take tests. Everything's a test. You got to be a specialist. I get that. All right. Whatever. But why would a trainer come in and add to that misery? Why would a trainer come in and demotivate your salespeople? See, I'm all about motivation. Because if you don't have the motivation, you can't sell anything. You can't close. You can't ask for the sale. And what trainer out there is saying don't ask for the sale? Because the market's... The market's changed, it's shifted, people don't want to be pressured. That's not pressuring to ask for the sale. It's disrespectful, not asking for the sale. If you want to respect your customer, if you want your customer to respect you, you ask for the sale. See, asking for the sale and sales period is confidence. Confidence builds motivation, right? Confidence. How do you build confidence? You build confidence with training. Reputitious. 
Okay? Over and over and over. Practicing. That's how you build confidence. You train. But it's got to get. It's got to be the right training. You got to have the right training. Contact the car shark. We want to come in and we want to train. That's what we do. We motivate first and we train. But you got to have the energy. Dealers, general sales managers, managers, you got to put the energy back in your store. You got to figure out how to put the energy back in your store. Then, then the motivation and training comes. Every one of your sales meetings has got to be positive. You got to be positive in your sales meeting. You don't call out somebody who's not performing to their potential. You motivate them. You help them. You motivate them. You help them. You motivate them. You help them. See, I say things three times so you remember. Now, if there's anything in this video that you like, go ahead, like it and share it. Otherwise, if you want to see more of these videos, go ahead and subscribe. Click on that little sharky icon down there. Subscribe, hit the bell button. Every time I upload a new video, you'll be notified. Now do yourself a favor. My name is Jimmy Prater. Go close something. Yeah.